Welcome back to our second annual spring event. We have an amazing lineup of brand new features to show to you today. Plus, three of you are winning a free Framer themed Creator Micro 2 by Work Louder. So stick around till the end for more details on that. Now, it's been a big six months since our last event, and in that time, more people than ever have jumped in and started building with Framer, which makes sense. It's faster, it takes fewer people, and you only have to take a glance at the Framer gallery to see that the end result can be absolutely stunning. This also makes it understandable why now over 30% of Y Combinator startups are choosing to launch with Framer. We've also seen amazing growth on the Framer marketplace, with over 200 plugins now available since our launch in the fall. And of course, a completely revamped experience for customers and creators with templates, with huge payouts happening every single month for template creators around the world. On the product side of things, since our last event, we've shipped over 35 updates. That's more than one per week if you're keeping count at home. Our new analytics now give you more detailed visibility into your traffic, reducing and even for some completely eliminating the need to rely on external analytics platforms. We also continue to make major updates to our CMS, improvements to galleries, on-page navigation, sorting, and a brand new mobile experience that makes editing or publishing on the go super easy. And on the design front, we've introduced a ton of game-changing features. We launched layout templates to give you guaranteed consistency and easy global changes for your sites. Selection colors for making fast changes or clearing up subtle color inconsistencies that have a way of spreading throughout your projects. All of this is part of our commitment to making Framer the best platform for designers to build professional sites at any scale. But today, we're here to talk about what's next for designers and the people they work with. We've got four new releases to share that include a little something for everyone that we think you're going to love. And as always, this isn't a preview event. None of this is coming soon. Everything we show you today will be available today. There's a lot to cover, so let's get started. Today, analytics take a massive leap forward in Framer, starting with funnels. When analyzing conversion rates, you need something specific to track. That's why you'll now see a tracking ID field when selecting linked elements like buttons. Framer will suggest an ID based on context, but you can change it to whatever you like. Since we have multiple buttons linking to the Get Started page, we'll assign unique IDs to each. Then we'll head over to analytics and create a new funnel. To track clicks, we simply add the IDs we've already set up. This gives us a clear picture of how our page is performing, which is great because now it's time to optimize with A-B testing in Framer. When you start a test, Framer will create a duplicate variant automatically. Let's say we want to test a dark version of this page. We'll make the changes directly on that variant, then hit configure. Just like with funnels, we'll define the steps we want to measure. When you're ready, publish the site. Half of your visitors will see the control variant, the other half will see the test variant. Framer begins collecting results immediately. If enough data is collected, a winner is automatically chosen at 90% certainty. If not, you'll get an estimate of how long it'll take based on current traffic. When you're confident, stop the test and apply the winning variant. This is the fastest and simplest way to go deeper with analytics and testing, no code required. Advanced analytics are free to try on every business plan and fully available on all enterprise plans. If you've been on the fence as to whether or not you should be running your marketing site on Framer, let these updates be your sign. It's time. Next. We've been hard at work on some serious updates and we've got Joseph to give you a look. Today, we're excited to introduce a complete reimagining of vector editing in Framer, allowing you to seamlessly draw and edit paths anywhere on the canvas, 
build and scale cohesive icon libraries, and create next level animations and micro interactions without ever leaving Framer or writing a single line of code. The new vector menu gives you everything you need to create and edit logos, icons, and illustrations directly on the canvas, anywhere you can insert layers. We know you love designing from scratch in Framer, so proper native vector editing is key for keeping your workflow clean. And as your projects grow, keeping cohesive sets of graphics organized and easily accessible can become more of a challenge, which is exactly why we're introducing vector sets. A vector set now allows you to bundle together groups of vector graphics, giving you a brand new browsing and search experience and a dedicated canvas to create and edit beautifully consistent sets of icons, along with the added power and flexibility of variables to make your icons even more customizable. You'll find a new vectors section on the assets panel where you can insert, edit, or create new vector sets. Or if you've already started drawing on the canvas, you can just right click and choose create vector set. Or if you've already got a set of SVG icons on your computer, you can now drag them directly onto the canvas and Framer will turn them into a new vector set automatically in one step. You'll be brought into a dedicated canvas with all the vector tools you might need and an add button to continue growing the set. And when you insert a vector set on a page, you'll get a whole new visual browsing and search experience that makes it incredibly easy to find the right icon. Vector sets also support variables, like stroke color or opacity, for example, to give you as much flexibility as you need to customize each instance of an icon. And by combining multiple properties, you could easily create duotone or multicolored icons from a single vector set. And of course, each instance is easily scalable. We've also gone ahead and revamped the icon sets available in the insert menu, all with the new browsing experience. Vector sets also unlock a brand new animation effect, the stroke effect, which gives you entirely new properties to animate the length, gap, and offset of a path, plus three unique ways to make it loop, unlocking a whole new level of animation and frame. You can create an infinite logo animation, bring icons and illustrations to life, or create beautiful micro interactions with just a few clicks. And that's vectors, inline editing, vector sets, and brand new stroke animations, an all new design experience, now in Framer. This completely rebuilt experience for vectors lays a lot of groundwork for more design focused features to come that we can't wait to share with you. But for now, we'd like to share something else we're excited about. Introducing Wireframer, a fresh new way to kick off your next site in Framer. Unlike other AI tools that try to do everything, Wireframer focuses on generating clear, purpose-built layouts that focus on structure, not style, helping you move fast while leaving the aesthetics in your hands. Here's how it works. You can type in your own prompt or choose from one of our presets. Let's start by generating a landing page. It's fast, like really fast. The result is clean, minimal, and fully responsive. And once you generate something, Wireframer will actually suggest edits to help you explore different layout ideas. Think copy changes, additions, alternative sections, and more. It's all designed to help you iterate quickly without starting over. And those suggestions aren't one and done. You can always follow up with your own requests to explore more options. Let's say we want an interactive navigation that expands and collapses on mobile. Done. Framer not only selects the right section, it makes it responsive out of the box. Since Wireframer is built specifically for Framer, layouts just work. No extra steps needed. And just like that, we've got a responsive, interactive landing page ready for us to customize and publish. Also, Wireframer isn't just for one pagers. At any point, add another page and keep building. Your whole site starts here. No matter what you're working on, Wireframer gives you a smart place to start. Build landing pages, portfolios, blogs, teasers, personal sites, you name it. This is only the beginning. With time, Wireframer will keep evolving with more layouts, more variations, and more possibilities. 
because everything happens in Framer. We can't wait for you to get your hands on this, but AI isn't just helpful for whole pages. Sometimes you have a specific idea that you know is possible, but you just don't have the technical know-how to get it done. That's where our next release comes in. Ever had an idea for custom components but felt blocked by code? You're not alone. That's why we built Workshop, to turn ideas into working components just by describing them. Let's try it out. We can launch Workshop straight from the component panel or the quick menu. It opens a chat where we can build anything we can think of. And if we're not sure where to start, there are example prompts to help spark new ideas. Let's start with one of the examples and create an analog style clock that shows the real local time. Once the prompt is submitted, Workshop generates our new component in seconds, dropping it onto our canvas, complete with built-in properties that we can tweak to our liking. Want to add more styling, properties, effects, or functionality? Just keep the conversation going. We can tell Workshop what we want to change or add, and it'll update the component in real time. It even suggests ways to make your component better. So you're not just building faster, you're building smarter. Workshop also makes it easy to create effects that used to feel out of reach, like an image card with an interactive 3D tilt. Just describe what you want and it builds it for you. Like magic, but real. We can keep enhancing and experimenting by adding details to the prompt, like asking for a screen reflection or glow on hover with an adjustable intensity. Workshop instantly updates the component with those changes so you can keep pushing your ideas further. If something ever feels off, just let Workshop know or roll back to a previous version. And while there's no need to touch code, the full component lives within the assets panel, ready to edit or reuse like any other code component in Framer. Workshop is just getting started. From bold creative ideas to powerful utility components, you can build it all right now. And as the AI continues to improve, so will the possibilities. Whether it's standout visuals or smart functionality, Workshop gives everyone the tools to bring big ideas to life. We're really excited about these AI features. For page building, the speed, simplicity, and neutral design approach feels like the ideal balance that gives you the superhuman speed that AI has to offer, while also giving you much more direct creative control than other AI-powered site building experiences. Component generation makes your more technical or wild ideas possible faster and easier, and we think you're going to love building with both of them. And just a note on the use of AI and Framer. Design has matured a lot over the past decade. As an industry, we've moved beyond being territorial about design patterns, and more than ever, it feels like we're all speaking a similar visual language, using the same kit of parts to create new and meaningful experiences that are familiar to the end user. Taking that into consideration, our approach to AI isn't about replacing the designer. It's about using these common shared patterns to provide great starting points and automating repetitive design tasks so you can spend more time focusing on what makes your work unique. It's about giving you all the tools to execute at your best and making those tools entirely optional. Everything we've talked about today is part of a bigger vision, one that lets designers do more of their work inside Framer, marketers get more out of our platform, and just removing bottlenecks for teams in general when it comes to publishing and updating sites. We think the future is incredibly bright for designers and builders of all kinds, and we can't wait to see what you build. Now, if you want a chance to win that Framer-themed Creator Micro 2 keyboard, here's what to do. Just post your favorite announcement from today on X or Instagram and include our handle, Framer, and we'll pick three random winners on Friday, May 23rd. Bonus points if you tell people what you're going to build with these features. But that doesn't increase your odds of winning. It's just fun. And that's it for this year's spring event. Thank you so much for joining us today. Until next time, we'll see you as always on the internet.